Well, we appreciate the questions. This is a very good one I want to address, and it has to do with how does the relationship between current draw being high or low and pressure being high or low, how does it work into systems that have return type systems as opposed to returnless? Well, I grabbed an old sample of a return system fuel pressure regulator. We have vacuum operating, a little extra pressure when you tip into the throttle. And if you had too much return from the rail back to the tank, you'd essentially be moving the same amount of fuel through the pump, so current would remain the same, but pressure would be low. So a little difference in that regard. How on the other hand, on a regulator, if you think about the ways it could fail, besides of obviously leak right here at the diaphragm, which is the most common way, um, you could have it bottlenecking or keeping too much pressure on the rail, and that'd be a deadhead of pressure, which is something you don't typically see with a returnless system. So you would see high current and high pressure and that would pretty much tell you you have a bad fuel pressure regulator. So some differences, but some similarities, so you can still use the thought process to diagnose.